It's wise to monitor your exertion level with the perceived exertion chart. Simply select the number on the scale that most accurately reflects how hard you feel you're working and adjust your exertion accordingly. For instance, if you're working above a 16 in the aerobic stage or have difficulty breathing or cannot talk comfortably at a conversational level, you should slow down. Likewise, if you perceive your exertion level to be lower than a 7 in the warm-up, you might work harder. Before you work out, take a moment to review the following precautions. Remember, it pays to be safe. And don't forget to have fun. Hi, I'm Susan Anton. As an actress and a performer, I find that I'm sometimes in need of losing a few pounds fast. I have found the Slim Addicts method to be one of the easiest, safest, most effective ways of burning that fat. Simply put, it's a low-fat, high-nutrition eating plan coupled with regular aerobic exercise to help you be a healthier, happier you. Okay, let's get started. All right, come on. All right, everybody, march it out. Get ready for your warm-up. Here we go. Step, step, touch, step, touch, double. Great, step, touch, and double. Shoulder, double. Shoulder, shoulder, great. Elbows, two of them, great. Single, single, double. Full arm, one, two. Two. Great. Walk it forward and reach. Bring it back. Inhale. Exhale to the side. Up in. Grapevine. Reach. Reach. Grapevine. Nice little warm up stretch. Do it again. One more time. You ready to punch on over? That's it. Three and four to the shoulders. Three. Punch it down. Yeah. To the shoulders. Work the back of your arms. Start to warm them up. Reach, reach, reach. To the shoulders. Yeah. Punch it down and hook. Yeah. To the shoulders. Now, step, point your toes, bring your arms across the chest, great. Add the knees, two, three, four. Bring your knee up, don't bend down to it. And step back, again, back, again. Last one, lift it, lift it, and lift it. Three and four and pulse. Two, three, four, open up. Two, three, four, bring it together. Two, three, and four, open. Bring together for two, and two. Two, open up. Two, bring it together. And open, together. And open from the top. Step, touch. Two of them. Great. Step, touch. Step, touch, step, touch. Shoulder. Shoulder. Again. Elbows. Two. Two of them. 
Great. Other side. One and two pull on. Great. Other side. And walk it forward. Reach up. Bring it back. Inhale. Exhale to the side. Do it again. Yeah. Whoo. Great bind. Reach. Reach. You start to get nice and warm now. Reach. Reach. Do it again. Yes. Reach. Reach. All right. And reach. Punch it over. Now and reach for it. Yeah. Great. Bend your knees. That's it. And punch it down. Punch it. Bring it to the shoulders. And reach it over. Yes. Again. To the shoulder. All right. Punch it down and go for it. Yeah. Two. To the shoulder. Step, touch. Step, touch. Step. Point your toes. Bring your arms across. All right. At the knee. Knee. Lift. Lift. You got it. This exercise helps to strengthen the shin. Singles. One, two, six, seven, eight. Again. Other side. Open. Right. Bring it front. And singles. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Again. Now stretch. This is a calf stretch. The knee is directly over the heel, and the weight of the upper torso is supported on the bent leg. The toe and the heel of the back leg are in a straight line. Reach, open, open line. Great. And breathe. Yeah. Stretch the back of the In this soleus stretch, the hip and the knee are in a straight line, and the knee is slightly bent. In this hamstring stretch, the weight of the upper torso is supported on the bent knee. Take it side. Two more. Last one to the side. Last time. Last one. And take it over the top. Now walk it. And march it. Walk it. Really march it. Yes. Great line. Come on, baby. Shake it. One more chance. Great line. Come on, now, girl. I mean, they want to dance. Come on, now, baby.
two more. Last one. Into the corner. Last one. <laughs> Bring it back to the top. Here we go. And Forward. Uh -huh. Forward. And back. Right. Take it side. Two more. Walk it front. Side. Take it side. Yes. You go. Rocket Side. One. 
and march it. March it up, real good. Over it. March it. Never stop. Over it. March it. All you got. Last time. And take it over the top. Great fun. Shake it, shake it. Great fun. Okay, now you want to keep up? We're going to start to really burn some calories now, okay? That's it. You've got it? Punch it down. You got it. Bring it forward. Out, out, in, in, walk it back. Out, out, in, in. Punch it down. And punch it. And punch it. Again, walk it forward. Walk it. And last walk time. Back. Out, out, in, in, or walk it. Pivot it, walk it back, walk it. Pivot, step, 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 walk it. Pivot, step, 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 you got it. And pivot, do it again. Four more. Pivot, walk it. Three more. Pivot, really walk it. Two. Pivot, Last walk one. It. Chasse forward. Five, six, seven, eight. Five, six, seven, eight. Chasse forward. Get into it. We'll walk it back. Do it again. That's it. Have fun. Woo! Walk it back. All right. Do it again. Last time. Then back to the top. Walk it back to the top. Here we go and punch it down. with the pivot. Walk it. And pivot. Walk, walk, walk. You got it. Pivot. Step, step, step. Woo. Walk, two, three, four, step, pivot. turn. Four Do more. Yes. Put a little hip in it. Have some fun. You got it. Woo. Walk it. Chasse yeah. forward. Back, two, three, four, five, six, seven, chasse, forward. Do it. Last time. And bring it back. To the top. Touch. Touch, two, one, two. Touch, two. Step together, touch, two. Take it forward. Reach, reach, down, down, back. Reach, reach, bring it in. Punch it down. Last time, walk to the side and pivot. Pivot. Walk. And pivot. Walk. Pivot. Walk it. Pivot. Four more. Pivot. All right. Two more. Pivot. Last one. Chasse forward. Back for eight. Walk it back, eight. You got it now. Walk it. Chasse Woo. forward. Yeah. And back for eight. Two more, chasse. Woo. Take it back. One chasse more forward. Woo. To the top. To Two the touches. Top. Yeah. Touch, touch, step, step, touch, touch, walk step, it walk it forward. Reach, reach, bring it back. Punch it down. That's it, hang in there, you got it. Walk it forward. Reach, reach, Take bring it back. It walk it back. And reach, reach, And bring walk it with a pivot. It.
Walk two, three, four, step, and turn, clap. Walk two, three, four, step, and turn, clap. Do it again. Last one. Chasse forward. Take it back. Chasse forward. Back for eight. Four, three, two, chasse forward. Back eight. Do it again. Chasse forward. Back for eight, last time. And touch it. Punch it down. Do it again. Touch two, walk, walk, touch two, walk two, forward. And reach. Bring it in and walk it back. Reach, reach. Touch it down. Punch it. Do it again. Yes. Walk it forward. And reach, reach. Bring it in and walk it back. Walk to the side and pivot. Walk two, right. three, four, step, turn. You should be feeling this now. I know I am. Ha. Yes. Whew. We're trying to get you into your toes right here. So you want to get your heart really pumping. Yeah. Two more. The zone that's saying is not Last one. Remember that. Chasse right. forward four times. Yeah. Take it back. Four. Bring it back. Four, three, two, one, chasse forward. Back eight. And finish. March it up. Get your heart rate really working up there now in your target zone. Work up a good sweat. Grapevine. You got it. Okay. Grapevine. Last time. Now, shuffle, shuffle. Step back, step back, bring it in. Step back. That's it. All right, this time, shuffle, step back, kick it, and kick it. That's it. Shuffle, back step, kick ball change, right, kick ball change. Do your great run. Step out, step out, bring it on around. And walk. Great run. Always start with step, the outside step, foot first. You got it. Walk it. Great run. Step outside out. foot. Bring it on around. Yeah. Walk it. Great run. Outside foot step touches out. to the side. To the Reach up, reach down, bring it back. You got it. Put a lot of energy into it now. Last time. Woo. Yeah. Great fine side. You got it. Woo. Two oh, more. Yeah. <laughs> Last one. You got to looking good. Shuffle to the side. Woo. Step. Back step, step, yeah. side step together, shuffle. Back step, step, side step together, shuffle. Back step, step, side together. Two more with the kickball change. Last time.
You got it, let me see. Shuffle it. Step out, bring it in. Shuffle it. Step out and bring it in. Now shuffle. Set a kick, hit. Shuffle. Set a kick it and see. Yeah. You're looking so fine, walk it. I said, great fine. Reach out, come on, one more time. Walk it, great fine. Step out, step out, do it with me, yeah. Walk it, I said, great fine. Take it to the front, come on and see. You're gonna look real fine. Yes, indeed, keep on working now. You and me, take it to the front, reach for the sky. One more time, now, now, take it to the left, reach down, another way, you go into town, do it again, what do you see, you're looking so fine, look at me, say shuffle, step back, step in, shuffle, Ooh. shuffle, step back, step in, shuffle, Shuffle, kick it real fine. Shuffle it, kick it, kick it. Shuffle, and kick it again. Walk, walk, great fun. Touch, 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 dig it in. Walk, walk, great fun. Touch, 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 do it again. Walk, I said great fun. Last one. And walk it, walk it. Great fine. Step back, step back. Bring it to the front. Walk it. Great fine. Step back, step back. Woo! Walk it. Great fine. Step back. You guys looking good. Last time. Reach up, reach down, bring it back. Reach up, reach down. Four, three, two, side. one, and end. Take a moment now to monitor your perceived exertion. Pick up your weights and let's go. Lift it, lift it. When working with, with weights, elbows. make sure that your movements are smooth and controlled. Do it two times. Again. Single. Reach out in front. Other side. Two, three, four, one, two, one, two. Singles, 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 singles. Reach up. Two, three, If you're just beginning, four, it's all right to work without any weight. Three, four, and one, two, one, you can gradually two, build up to no more than three pounds for this routine. Singles. Take a break. Roll your shoulders. Other side. Do it again. Walk over. Roll your shoulders. If you don't have weight, that's okay. Your elbows should always be slightly bent. Pull it back. Give your elbows. Bring it in and lift the foot. Yeah. Okay. Punch it down. Punch it. Punch it. Do it two times. Punch it. Punch it. 
Be sure to take breaks when you feel tired. The shoulders should always stay down. Reach, reach, do it twice. Reach, reach, again. Reach, reach, and reach. Keep your elbows up. Take a break. Relax your shoulders. There you go. You turn break. Please note that the knees always are slightly bent. The elbows should be held at shoulder level. Take a break. Roll it and roll it. Take a break. Again. Again. Take it to the top. Now lift it up. These are called rows. And roll it. And roll your boat. Yeah. Take it to. Try not to snap the elbows. Again, always keep them slightly bent. The rib cage stays stationary. Last time. And hold it. Take a moment now to monitor your perceived exertion. Okay, let's get ready for our cool down. You're gonna love this because we're going to just take it nice and easy. Yes, to the side. One, Everybody two, one, on two, go. three. Do it again. Four more. Three more. Two more. Last one. Great. Let's tango to the corner. Step, step, quick, quick, quick. Yeah. Slow, slow, quick, quick, quick. Slow, slow. Quick, quick, quick. Four more. Yeah. Last one. To the center and flat feet. Walking up and back. Flat feet. Lift to the sky and up the stairs.
step, step back, step, step back, and up, six. Pull your arm up, heel. Take it from the top. Two, two, one, two, three, and one. Step together, step together, step together, step, touch, step together, step together, step together, step, touch. Again. Four more. Again. Last one. Ready for the tango. Walk, walk it, walk it, hit it, yeah. Slow, quick, one, quick. Two, three, hold. Slow, slow, one, quick, two, quick, three, quick. Yeah. Slow, slow, quick, 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 quick. Slow, slow, quick, quick, quick. Great. Two more. One more. Yeah. Three more. Two more. Last one. Tango. Walk, walk, one, two, three, hit it. Up on your toes and back. There you Up are. On your toes. One more. Walk it flat. Push it in. Push it <laughs> out. Step, touch, step, touch, step together, Elbow step, touch. And hold for a hamstring stretch. Your weight is supported on the bent leg. Walk it. Turn it in. Take it on your feet and walk it back. Back in place. You got it. Take it up the stairs. And reach. Toes, toes, flat, flat, toe, toe, flat, flat, toe, toe, flat, flat. Nice and easy. Yeah. You got it. Step together, step together, step together, step, touch, step, touch, step, touch, step together, step, touch. There we go, yeah. Full arm. Walk. And press it back. Hold for a calf stretch on the back leg. The toe and the heel are in a straight line. And press it back. And walk it. And press it back. All right, flat feet and walk it. Walk it. Woo. Up the stairs. Up the stairs.
You did a great job. Now it's your turn to lay back and relax. Inhale through your nose, exhale through your mouth, and bring your heart rate down. We're going to stretch now. Lay back. Bring the right knee into the chest. Be sure to hold on to the back of the thigh and relax. Flex the foot and press it to the ceiling. And hold. Be sure the opposing hip stays on the floor. Point and flex. Point, flex, point, flex, point, flex, point, flex, point, circle out. Two, three, four, five, six, circle seven, circle eight. Bringing the knee down, changing legs to the left knee into the chest, and hold for hamstring stretch. Again, breathe in through the nose, out through the mouth, and relax. Flex the foot and press the heel to the ceiling, and hold. Again, stretching the hamstring and the back of the leg. Point, flex, point, flex, point, flex, point, flex, point, flex, point. Circles, gently rotating the foot from the ankle. and change direction. Bring the knee back into the chest and to the floor. Straighten the right leg, bring the left knee up. Using the opposing arm, gently pull the knee to the floor. just to the point of tightness and hold. Change legs. Putting gentle pressure on the bent knee. Let the knee drop towards the floor. Stretching just to the point of tightness and hold. Bring both knees forward and come to a sitting position. With the left leg in front of the right, lean forward from the hips using your hands to support your upper torso. For a hip stretch, leaning to the right, make sure the opposing hip stays on the floor. Come back center. Lift up and change your lead leg. And gently let the body come forward with the weight on the hands. An inner thigh stretch. And a hip stretch. Come back center. Lift up, come to a kneeling position. Arch the back towards the ceiling. 
and release to a neutral position without hyperextending the spine. Stretch to the ceiling again and release. The right knee comes forward with the knee directly over the heel. Come to a standing position for a calf stretch on the left leg. And turn to the other side. Your weight is supported on the bent leg. Keep the weight in the center of the muscle. And hold. Come center. Knee should stay slightly bent. Take the stretch to the side. The other side. And finish. You've got a major event coming up in less than a week, and you desperately want to fit into that new dress or suit. So how do you lose a few pounds quickly, and above all, safely? Here to help answer questions about short-term weight loss, as well as give us a general introduction to weight management, is our registered dietitian, Sue Luke. Hi, Sue. Hello, Susan. At any given time, over half of all Americans are on a diet or think they should be. Many of us, myself included, have fallen prey to fad diets. They simply don't work. Slimatics is not just another diet. It's an organized approach to healthier, happier living. Right, Sue? That's right, Susan. Many Americans are either on a diet or they're off a diet. And I refer to this as black and white type of thinking. When you're on that diet and you're following that plan, you're in the white zone. When you're off the diet and you're eating whatever you can get your hands on, you're in the black zone. And what we ultimately want to do on this is to get you into what I call the gray zone. You'd be interested in knowing that there's one shade of white and there's one shade of black and there's 55,000 shades of gray. And the slematic approach is going to be getting you into the lighter gray zone, something that you can live with for the rest of your life. We have with us Dr. Joseph Buscarin, who is director of the Human Performance Lab at Sports Medicine Boston and is himself a world-class athlete. Dr. Buscarin, are you familiar with the term yo-yo dieting? Yo-yo dieting refers to the person who has an instant of motivation that they want to lose weight and then they go on a, a big crash diet uh, after which they feel not satisfied from their food and they tend to overeat after that. Uh, a better way to approach it would be to educate yourself about the composition of different foods eat to your satisfied, but if you're eating the right foods, you'll be able to maintain that diet and lose weight. The trick is to satisfy most of your hunger cravings with tasty, nutritious foods that are low in fat and high in bulk and fiber. If people could become more conscious of the fat content in their diet and reduce intake by even one tablespoon per day, they could shed 10 pounds in a year. Let's look at what five pounds of human fat looks like. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> and how people can cut those tablespoons of fat out. This is what, Sue? This is a replica of five pounds of human fat. It's big, it's bulky. And when you can lose weight in a sensible, slow way, this is what you can lose. This is not attractive. I know I don't want this on my body. N no, most people do not. But let's compare it to what five pounds of, this happens to be a roast beef, but this is what lean muscle looks like in the body. And people can see that five pounds of fat is very big and bulky compared to the muscle in your body. So oftentimes, underneath all of this, we have lean, wonderful muscle. What we have to do is decrease our fat, get rid of this, so we can get down to what we've got that's good, right? That's right. And the best way to get rid of it is by reducing the fat in your diet. It's my pleasure to introduce to you Dr. Johanna Dwyer, professor of medicine at Tufts University Medical School nutritionist at New England Medical Center, and senior advisor for the Surgeon General's Report on Nutrition and Health. How can people start cutting fat out of their diet? What would you suggest? Skim milk instead of whole milk, low-fat yogurt instead of high-fat yogurt, low-fat cheese, eating uh, lower-fat meats and poultry and fishes and things that are cooked in ways 
that are low fat preparation like broiling and baking. Mm -hmm. On the uh, the meats, one one thing that I find helpful is to eat the red and not the white. The white's all fat. Presently, the average American consumes six and a half pounds of fat per month. And if you'll take a look at this, this is what six and a half pounds of fat looks like. Equivalent to approximately 26 sticks of butter or margarine a month, which means that we're taking in approximately one stick of fat per day, or about 1,000 calories. And what we're going to try to do is teach you how to get rid of that fat in your diet and eat a much healthier, low-fat diet that can lead to lots of good health benefits. Another favorite fare for people to choose when they eat on the run is a tossed salad. And I marvel when I go to various restaurants and I see people saying, oh, I'm on a diet to lose weight and I'm going to have a tossed salad. And then I see them create the most horrible salad. A typical one would be what we see here. This particular salad has cheese and uh, pasta salad, some sunflower seeds, a lot of, uh, of potato salad on there. All of these things are high in fat. That salad, as you see it, is 784 calories, and it contains one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11 teaspoons of fat. So no, that is not a healthy choice. On the other hand, you can go to the same salad bar and make a very healthy salad. Try to stick with the vegetables that are not marinated in an oil or a salad dressing and add a little fruit to it. This particular salad, as you see it, is only 330 calories and add two slices of whole grain bread and leave off the fat and this salad has less than one teaspoon of fat in it. So this salad is about the same amount filling-wise, but it's half the calories. So watch out for that fat when you build that salad. This apple, orange, and piece of whole wheat bread weighs one pound, and it's 240 calories. In the other hand, I have a one and a half ounce chocolate bar, which weighs one and a half ounces and is 240 calories. What's interesting is this food, 10% of the calories are going to be lost just in the chewing and the digesting of it. Another 20% of the calories are going to be lost because of the fiber content and it's gonna go right through you. So this is really worth approximately 160 calories. Why the chocolate, which is mainly fat and sugar, is worth 240 calories. So you wanna be emphasizing more of these foods that are high in complex carbohydrate and fiber because you can see the net result is a lower calorie intake and it will fill you up. We have with us Dr. Joseph Buscarin, who is director of the Human Performance Lab. What do you think is wrong with the American diet? Well, the American diet uh, has far too much fat in it, and uh, the ideal diet for feeling good about yourself and for athletics is about 65% carbohydrates, and to accomplish that, you've really got to watch out for fat in your diet, so that would be my main recommendation, to watch out for the fat. Dr. Buscarin, how do you watch out for your fat? Well, generally, if you're eating uh, lean meats such as fish, chicken, and uh, lean red meat, they will contain uh, no more than 20% fat. And then if you complement that by a um, high proportion of vegetables, rice, grains, cereals, uh, and watch out for sources of fat like cheese, salad dressing, gravies, then you're going to be on the, the right track to improving your diet. There are three basic steps. Step one, begin by cutting down or eliminating certain dangerous foods and finding healthier alternatives to others. Try to avoid animal products high in cholesterol, such as egg yolks and liver. Once people have mastered or feel comfortable with step one, they can move on to step two. This is a little more strict. The first point is to reduce the amount of meat and cheeses consumed and replace them with chicken and fish. And now we're moving to the ultimate challenge, step three. Eat meat, cheese, poultry, shellfish, and fish as appetizers or condiments only, rather than as the main course. Have a small serving of the protein-rich food and a large serving of the foods grown in the soil, such as fruits, vegetables, and grains. While the three steps are progressively harder, you can use them as specific goals to work towards.
And once you've mastered each step, you will feel a sense of accomplishment. Remember, the payoff is a healthier, happier you.